racing. How you going there fellas? Here we go. We got the Walt the Walters Pilsener product of Germany 4.9% yeah. and I got Johnny and Peter. G'day guys. G'day guys. Uh, Sack on here. Coon Bar here and Trent from Trent's Travel Zones. Yeah, good to see you guys. Good to, good to speak to you. Yeah. So I well, actually so we've, we've, we've been together. Yeah, us. yeah. A few unfortunate things happened between us. No, yeah. not, not between us with you, you dickhead. You went overseas, <laughs> I lost my license and all the rest of the yeah. bullshit. Nothing happened between Just us. Just life. Yeah. Life, life, fucking life shit, happened. Trev, Trev, Trev's got so you, you want to propose your new your legal proposition to the Crown, Trev? No, not at no, all. No, no, I can say no. this is a live channel. Yeah. It's a live channel. Going live. It's live up. It's a Going live channel. Live. So life's a, a reality challenge. challenge. There's no ends. There's no ends thing. Is there, no, Trev? No, no. There's no, no ends thing. What you see is what you get. What you hear is what you get. What you see is what you get. <coughs> no That's how it should show. be. No, no adverts. No. no. Yeah. All right, cheers, fellas. So you go. Cheers, Tell me what you think of this. Cheers, Trev. The Vultures. The Vultures. Cheers, Trev. Good to see you again, mate. Yes, but again, do the review, mate. That's your caper, not ours. A few IPUs in there. 4.9%, not too bad. Bit of flavour, bit of IBUs, like you're saying. It's not a, a mild, light, wishy-washy beer. There's something there. It's That's some flavour, isn't it? Got a bit of fucking go on it. Mm. It's got a bit of head on it, too. It's, good. it's got a beautiful, creamy head. I'd say it's a creamy. German beer, yeah? Yeah, German beer, which means it's pure, too. There's no additive. 22 bucks a dozen down it, not quite right. You're kidding <laughs> Well, that's good. Yeah, yeah, they're, yeah, they're not quite right. Still yeah, down the but you know, twenty-two what? bucks a dozen. You can't go wrong. I've driven past it a couple of times. Yeah, but in QR, twenty-two bucks. Yeah, I've been in there. I've driven past a couple of times. What yeah. I what I know about not quite right for beers, new beers coming to Australia, they don't sell. And they have oh, a you would have loved it. They had this little package. They had a low and brown. They had they had oh, four four ca four cans for twelve dollars. All these three different German beers and the little you know the little grad wrap thing. I was thinking, oh, Trev would like that. That'd be a great review for him. Oh, well, I didn't buy him. You know, I said, I'll grab a dozen of these. That'll do it tomorrow. Mm. Oh, pardon me. How, how, much, how much a slab, Jono? 44 a slab. You know, what, what, a dozen for 22 bucks. Come in a dozen German bottles. beer. Look, I've never seen it before. Box of a dozen. So what it comes down to, these beer, I reckon, this is my slant on it, is they're trying to get a market in Australia. And because they've never heard of before, they're not getting in. Yeah. And the other companies try to slot them out and they sell theirs a bit cheaper yeah, than the yeah, competitors. Yeah. Nothing wrong with the beer though, is it? Yeah, there? but the beer gets close to use by date by a few months, Cut. so they sell it off cheap anywhere, not quite right to get rid of it. So it's sold. Doesn't matter they make a little bit on it, they've just got to sell it before the use by date, otherwise it's worth nothing. Where's the use by date? So That's to get the in the market. She's in the box. They're giving up themselves a the little bit box. to get in on the market unless they get pumped somewhere. So, Trip, just a, So, just, they need a salesman like me. Yeah, just a question for you. Um, a what? A salesman like you? Yeah. I was down at, um, down at the supermarket the other day and I bought a, a slab of Leo, mm. a Thai, yeah. Thai, Thai beer. Yeah. And went through the checkout and it was $38 or something. It was pretty cheap. Cheap. I got in the car, got home, and I was opening the box, putting the beers in the in the fridge, and I I, I noticed there's an expiry date on the box, and it was it expired already, like by two months or something, you three kidding? months, yeah, oh, by a long Do, way. Does that does that make the beer any any worse? Can you you know like if you buy cheese or you buy something that's yeah, expired for any lighter beers, it'll make them go off. Okay, and especially if they're in a clear bottle, that's even worse. Right. And any lighter beers, they couldn't handle travel. So anything from overseas, you... It's you, about two months expired. Yeah, but you're better off by buying from overseas darker beers because your lighter beers, that's why they called it an IPA, an Indian Pale Ale and a Porter, because they travelled overseas and they lasted because they were stronger alcohol. Oh, right. So your lighter alcohol can't handle a trip and they can't handle time. Like, I drank them, they were fine. You look, if they were okay. kept in a cool room, they probably would have been fine. But if they were in a fluctuating, like a tin shed, getting hot and getting real cold and real hot every year, for the time that they were there, they'd be fucked. And that was Audi, like Audi, and they, they, they're yeah. selling 
expired Leo Tyler. Well, Gopia. I never knew they were expired. Yeah, it's, uh, it's actually happened a couple of times, Trent. Mm. I had a six pack three days ago from Aldi and it was a Leo six pack. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, that's what it is. All right, cheers, fellas. Thanks, John. Thanks, cheers, guys. Good on you, Trent. Take Thanks, care, mate. everyone. We're having a uh, yep. great Friday lunch. We we're uh, here in Melbourne and uh, the weather is just pumping out. Melbourne in March, April is just the best weather in the whole wide yeah. world. You just don't want to be summer, anywhere else we're, uh... in the whole world. Oh, weather really. wise. <sighs> weather wise, beautiful. See you, guys. Good shoot. See you. Cheers, cheers guys. Bye.